Now for something completely different, we're going to go from Naked Magicians to, uh, to history. I know, total 180. But it's a new book that's chronicling a local man's experience in World War I. And the tale is told by a local author who is related to the book's subject. Tell us about your book and about who, that sub who the subject of your book is. Well, the title is Colonel Wilkinson's Diary, a okay. Kansas doctor in World War I, France. Hmm. And uh, Colonel Wilkinson was an MD surgeon who was my grandfather, my mother's father, and he volunteered at the age of 40 in 1917, which was a lot older, 100 wow. years ago, than a 40-year-old is today. And uh, when she died, I found his trunk, a steel trunk in her basement. Inside was a diary. One of the phrases in the diary that really hooked me for preserving the material was he said, I've got to go get the Kaiser. Hmm. He was gung-ho, and uh, that's an attitude that was very necessary for the reason we won the war that allied uh, spirit to win. Did he live here in Kansas City or where were they living at the time? Well, he lived in uh, Parkwood, a subdivision in Kansas City, Kansas that oh, okay. was new at that time. Yeah, it's down in, like, in Old Quindaro. Is where, right, 10th yeah. and Quindaro. And uh, so uh, those were new homes at the time and he mm -hmm. closed down his practice and uh, went over and volunteered and signed up. He spoke uh, constantly in the copy of worrying about his little Elizabeth back mm -hmm. in Kansas. This was when he was at Walter Reed Army Medical Center and later when he was commanding a field hospital in France. Yeah. As a doctor, he talks uh, very bluntly and uh, probably didn't know anybody had ever read this, so mm -hmm. he tells uh, some inside stories on what he thinks of the doctors he's working with, oh. referring to one as the prize boob of the Army. Oh, no. <laughs> and and uh, says uh, some stern things about uh, the people he works with in a very honest analysis. What does it mean now that we're getting ready to celebrate 100 years uh, since World War One ended. They're what the whole memorial and these uh, kinds of stories are about. Preserving that history, telling that story, telling my generation, your generation, and future generations uh, what made it possible for the USA to be here today like we are living in it in 2018. Yeah, it's a really local and unique look at World War I. And Joe Vaughn, the author, is going to be speaking this Saturday at the Overland Park Historical Society. And you can buy Colonel Wilkinson's diary locally at Rainy Day Books or online. Belinda?